Stephen. You're totally right, New Stephen. I mean, I bet Ursa Ariana probably expected that. It would have been over right there after she learned that filthy spot from Anna Tan. That was the same move she did to defeat Moro Loka on the last assault to, to retain her double championship there. And Tan, though. Her middle rope with that bulldog. Oh, look at this. Exposing the turnbuckle. Ursula down doesn't see it. Referee in, you know, prime position, but he can't do a darn thing about it. This is bloodshed. Ursula goes in the corner. Uh, back to the exposed turnbuckle. Now Anna Tan with... Oh, my God. What DDT that was. Never seen that before in my life. It's got to be over right here. It's got to be over right here. Only a one count? Are you kidding me? A one... I Ursa getting only a one, kicking out after a run after that huge DDT. Anna Tan furious at the referee, thought she came out of counted slow. Now Ursa Mountain here with these left and right mountain punches. Oh, but Anna Tan blocked it with the headbutt. Very few people have ever been able to block and or not get knocked out with those mountain punches. And Anna Tan did just that. And now Anna Tan goes for a referee. That was uncalled for. Oh, Anna Tan saves herself from getting launched outside, but goes anyway. Oh, springing back flip over the top of the middle rope to the outside. Oh, look at this. It's martial arts here. Man. Man, Ursa Ariana's got to be the total package. It's one of the most all-around competitors here. I mean, I mean, I, I, mean, I said she's more of a ground and pound specialist, but that doesn't mean she can, you know, just pull out some insane, you know, what, some insane, you know, Lucha Leap and move like that. That huge spring and back flip off the middle rope like we just saw there. And we saw this, we saw her as we, he fell with that huge, that, that, that combination. You know, of course, we all know, you know, Ursa Ariana is also a well-known, you know, a well, pretty good mixed martial artist as well, but pulling out all the stops here. Drop toe hold on Anna Tan, probably has a rowdy. She's going to do now. A huge uppercut to the throat of Anna Tan. Sets her up once more. What's she, can, what's she thinking here? All these combinations, but she switches it up a little bit. The legs only. The power. And Tan right back out of it. Goes for a crotch shot. I'm not sure that's going to work too well. But it's taken down the clothesline. Well, it was effective enough for the, to get the upper hand on Ursa Ariana on the, a, 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 a second ago. See, if anything, and Tan, of course, just like Brennan Gatiba, one of the dirtiest players in the game, will you know, take any advance, any cheap shot there is possible just to get the upper hand, just like we just saw. And now, hesitating, no, really wasting no time bringing in a, a still chair into the game. We all know what they can do. The still chair and just takes out the ref once more for no apparent reason. Wants to go for the chair. And, oh my God, this cracked over the skull. And, oh, just hitting him with it down the chair. Oh, no. This is what I'm talking about. Rock. No! My God, busted her ankle. Setting her up, no. Ref up, didn't see a darn thing. Well, I can't do anything about it anyways, but... Setting her up here. And neck breaker off the top rope. And I know it's freaking bloodshed, but, we, but this type of violence isn't really necessary. Oh, look at this! Oh my, that soul street cutter! This has got to be over folks right now. I mean, there's no way she's going to come back from that. Not at all. From a busted ankle and a busted neck now, but Anna Tan taunting, wasting time. Showboating here. I'm assuming it's quite over anyway. She's going for the count here. Wait a two count! Osorio managed to you know, dig down deep and kick out that huge onslaught. If it wasn't for Anna Tan's hesitation or in her showboating, that probably would have been it for Osorio right there. I only assume, but where's this momentum coming from? Oh, poke to the eye, cutting the momentum right there. You know, Anna Tan bringing it back. Repeated kicks to the gut. Slow down pace here. These two are just outwinded and, you know, you know, this well established. Even if Ursa Ariana were to win here, she still has one more opponent to face. And you can just see the energy draining from her. But out of nowhere, what a kick, my God! Took her head off with that kick. He fell over a... Oh, it's right here, folks! With a three count, yes, he got her! And Ursa Ariana's victorious! 
What a huge comeback! Look how winded she is, Rob. Coming down the aisle. And her partner from Florence, South Carolina, Renegade Diva. Then we see the We all saw what intended the chair all across Russell Ariano's ankle. We found that would for sure take up the single super kick for sure. But she still managed to use it to come out of nowhere and just and, and defeat Anna Tam. But now look at this, folks. Next we're gonna go against Renegade Diva now. Wait, wait, come, wait, wait a minute. Oh, come on. Then Ursa Ariana with her back with his wing for Renegade Diva to come out with this and that damn skilled chair across the throw. Look at this. Talk about disrespectful. I mean, there's still playing Renegade Diva's entrance music for crying out loud. Oh, come on. That's her, no, don't do this. No. Damn it. DT, that damn agent sensation with that. DT to the chair. Oh man, there's no way Ursula is gonna come back from this. No way. Bob Arnold forced to let this thing happen. Can't do a darn thing about it. However, running Diva has never gotten the ring yet, so the bill of a ring. So that obviously will have a slide. Now we know how it should Ursula is now. Look at this. Running Diva is going through the scrap, just picking the bones. And he did all the, all the damage there. Of course, Anatan staying close by ringside here in case something, I'm assuming, goes wrong with Renegade Diva so she can, you know, help her partner out. This is not right, Rock Doc. This is totally one-sided. Pretty much guaranteed to walk out a new double X champion here tonight. This, you're watching the downfall of Ursula here. This neck, a backbreaker, then the first neckbreaker. The cover, this is all over. This, Oh, wait a minute, kicks out! Renegade Diva shocked! Now she's just furious. Stop stooping to all levels here! Oh, Renegade Diva, obviously, like I said, all fierce is going to put all the stops here with that huge backbreaker. And working out. But I'm working on also on his entire body here. I would assume her body's going to be riddled with pain at this point. So we just saw me, Steven. But I don't know if he has a wrap. We don't know if this is. Oh my gosh. That Diva Buster is through a sword. Right on her neck. Oh, this has got to be right here. This has got to be right here. One, two, and. Wait a minute. And again. Also, I have to find the option kicking out once again. Now the referee gets it. We're gonna do that arm breaker with the referee. And the referee's down. Oh, man, one piece of wood. Oh, Anna Tam brings in the chair when the referee's down. Man, I, I wouldn't be surprised if Bob Arnold already sets in his resignation after this CPV. But now setting Ursula's face first on the chair and brings in another one. And Tete, wait a minute! A sweet chip, I don't know who did that! Wait, let's all polka! What's she doing out here? This is, what's, what the, no business out here! Wait a minute, what's Renegade Diva gonna do? Oh my god, did you see that? This is what Polka's damn gonna save Ursula Arena's life! If Renegade Diva was gonna grab that chair and wait a minute, it's in a tan now! My god, the referee didn't see a damn thing! My god, whoever knows what Polka just did there! Gave us all uh, enough time to come back there. I can see that she saved us because Renegade D was a fraction of a second away of ending this one by hitting her with a steel chair. And this little one came from behind on the top row. He hardly couldn't even see her. Took the chair away. Oh, what a kick! The offense he needs in the referee to occupy the action outside. And so it's on Blanca exposing a, a table. Trying to take out Anna Tan here. Make sure she won't interfere in this match like she's already been doing. And look at Sarano's taking it to Renegade Diva. And Tan gets a face shot in. This. Oh, what a nice shining wizard. Step in the middle of the ring here. Oh my god! Oh man, you say Lewis super kick. He's going to happen to Anna Tan in the last fall here. Look at this, he's not with the punches. And the referee lands as a knockout. This one's over. Here's your winner. And still, double X champion, Ursula Oriano.
Man, folks, this must be a repeat from Beach Party Slam. Again, Uso Ada walks out double champion with the assist with a with a save by Rosario Blanca. I mean, what's the why's Rosario Blanca been doing so? Uso Ada looks like some answers behind all this. But still, Uso Ada once again walks out as a still young double X champion.